Welcome, welcome back, back to Hanging with the Harrises. Harrison. Hey guys, welcome back to Hanging with the Harrises. I know y'all probably looking like, what in the world? I got my hair covered up because I am barbecuing. See that? We queuing. So I didn't want my hair to smell like smoke. So I look a little ratchet a little bit. It's okay. No worries. It's cool. It's cool. So I went to church today. I was great. The word was awesome. God is just so good. He's so, he's so strategic. That's what I wanted to say. So, um, yeah, let me show you guys what we're doing. So we got some chicken. I just took this chicken off. This is barbecue and then regular because my kids don't be wanting barbecue sauce. But I put some more just in case my nephew wants some or my husband. And then we also got some chicken breasts under there. That's for me. And then I'm getting ready to put some turkey burgers and steaks for Dominique. So it's a nice day today. And uh, I need to put some shoes on. So I ain't got no shoes. Let me see. Where are your slides? Your slides. One feet. Oh, okay. So, oh, here they go. Yeah, so we are um, outside barbecuing. Me and Dominique, he definitely is not barbecuing. He is actually just reminding me to go check the meat. <laughs> Let me find his shoes. I don't see them. I need some shoes on my feet. My feet is cold. I have no shoes on. Hmm. I don't want to put no shoe shoes on. I just want to put some on so one of my feet on the ground. Huh. Put my house slippers. I put these on just for now. Sorry, Jenny. Anyhow. What is going on back here? What y'all doing? Work night. Unbelievable. Mm. Who are you talking to? Mm, okay. Anyhow. Hey, put my stuff back on my bed, Jenny. Jenny, put that back. That's mine. You threw why you throw it over there? That's my stuff. Hi. See this? Look at that. Big baby. Big baby. All right, get off. I gotta check this chicken. Get off. <laughs> Girl. Lord, I'm trying to check this food. She's playing. I left my chicken on here. What's wrong with that girl? All right, y'all. So, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take this chicken in here. Hold on, guys. I'll be back for y'all. All right, guys. So, yeah, this is where we at for today. Barbecue outdoors. It's nice out. It's not cold, it's not hot. Just perfect temperature. I'm gonna grab these steaks, y'all. Hold tight. All right, guys, I'm back. I got Dominique's steaks. I'm getting ready to toss them over here. Ooh, it's hot, Jesus. It's hot, hot. It's really hot, y'all. I'm gonna have to check my chicken, too. I'm gonna get myself a justice and move it, because I don't want it's gonna dried out chicken. Okay, so them bad boys is on there. We're gonna let them do what they supposed to do. My chicken is basically done. I'm just letting it brown on another side. And then once it brown on that side, I'm gonna take it off. I'm gonna take it off. All right, y'all. Let me take this in the house. A little lighter thing. Be right back, folks. Hold on. Okay, guys. So yeah, as I was saying um, about service today, when I tell you, it is so refreshing to just hear the word, like line upon line and precept upon precept. Y'all probably see my mascara. I was crying my eyes out today. I just love to worship. And worship is just not only, you know, in public, but in my private time. But when we you in corporate worship with other believers, it's nothing like it. It really isn't. But I, I'm just so grateful and thankful for... <laughs> how good God is, how good God is, he's faithful, so yeah, I am, Dominique is washing dishes in there, listening to his music, I'm out here making sure dinner is done, we got some scalloped potatoes in the oven, 
and I have some um, baked beans I'm getting ready to put on the stove and cook as well. Are probably not on the stove. I'll probably put them in the oven with the scallops and just let them do their thing. Yeah, that's probably what I'm going to do. Yeah, I'm about to make some baked beans and then dinner will be done. They'll have scallops, baked beans, and um, chicken, uh, steak, hot dogs, or hamburger, whichever. So I cook that because through the week, I don't want to be cooking a whole lot. And I know that will last us, you know, through the week. My nephew's here too today, so he's going to eat with us as well. So I'm just making sure I got a nice variety of different kind of meats. Um, I'm eating chicken and I did buy some salmon, but I'm not gonna put it on the grill today. I don't feel like seasoning another thing. So uh, I'll just have that salmon throughout the week. Or maybe I put one on the grill because I have two salmon fillets. They got the skin on. I might throw it on or I'll just have Dami start the grill again another day this week or whenever it's nice again outside so that we can. But yeah, it's been pretty darn good day today it's been a good day it's been a pretty good day if i might say so myself um the joy of the lord is just god is doing something amazing y'all and i remember declaring this to our prayer call that we would not miss it and i believe that um as i just we just continue to stay in the place of trusting god and being in our secret place and listening for his voice and following his instructions and being obedient that we will not miss the move of god and i'm confident that i'm not gonna miss it i refuse to miss it so yeah i am feeling good i weigh in tomorrow for weight watchers i haven't done anything crazy i haven't eaten off of what my count my you know calorie count was i worked out every day this week except for today and wednesday wednesday i did i think i did no i didn't do anything on wednesday because i had a doctor's appointment early in the morning um i had to pick my kids up my day just kind of got thrown off just because i had to go to the doctor's office um but i might still do something even if it's just like 20 minutes you know something today an ab workout or something or you know something just something today so that um you know i get those uh that my workout done because i planned on working out at least six days a week and so i'm a day off of my goal however i'm not tripping but yeah and then y'all see my nails i did all by myself i think i did a good job if you can see them so it's like sparkles a uh, complete purple one like a tip sparkle sparkle and then a tip purple yep i did it myself and i didn't even have to go to pinterest i just kind of was talking on the phone and excuse my ashy hands they kind of ashy because i was um with your magic and i cut them really short just because i don't like long nails that's how i break my nails but i cut them also short because when i go to have my procedure on when thursday um they don't you cannot have acrylic nails but what i was thinking was um, that they just don't want them long so that they can't put that thing on your finger to make sure your temperature and stuff is right. I got food and barbecue sauce on my hands. But to make sure, not your temperature, Lord, your pulse and blood pressure and everything is stable. So I cut them really, really short. Prayerfully, it's not too long or whatever. So I called and never responded back when I asked about it, but I wanted to be sure. So I just went with what I felt could be right. <laughs> and prayerfully, it is. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. We really haven't done much today. I still have to do the girl's hair. I have some work to finish. I have um, some guidelines, prayer guidelines that I need to send out to um, those that will be fasting and praying with our ministry. And um, so, yeah, I'm going to make sure I do that, send it out via email. And yeah, that's, that's pretty much it, y'all. Like, I'm I've been having a really good day. I, my daughter's hair, they're, both of their hairs need to be washed. Like that's on the top of my to-do list. If I have to push, cause we're starting a fast on Wednesday and I wanted to make sure they had the guidelines at least by Monday. Um, but if it has to be on exactly on Monday, then that would be fine. I just want to be sure that I get everything done in a timely manner. But my kid's hair is like priority. I have to get that, that done, you know, so. Yep, I'm going to probably go in here. Once this chicken and stuff come off this grill, I'll be good to go in the house and actually start washing their hair and stuff like that at least. Or having them get in the shower so I can wash it. And then, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to make sure that they are together, right? <laughs> so, yeah, that's my day for today. This has been a beautiful Sunday so far. And I'm just grateful for how the Lord continues to allow us to, you know, see the days that we do see. And praise Him for the opportunities that we have to be, you know here in his presence all right so hey danny all right guys i'll let you guys go i'm gonna go check on the rest of this meat and i'll see you guys later